Ladies and gentlemen, welcome you faces to a Minecraft project, my Minecraft Let's Play world, where I'm trying to build the most random awesome things that I possibly can, and at the same time, trying to complete all the advancements and achievements in Minecraft. In the last episode, we made some serious progress with the big underground basement that I made super cool and super awesome. We managed to get the vine farm and the glowberry farm up and running, as well as an unlimited lava source to feed us and fuel us for the rest of our adventures. Now, that's all well and good saying we've built lots of stuff, but we did nothing along the way to complete our advancements. And that is not good enough. And I tell you something, I've read the comments and I hear what you guys are saying. And that is that the people want progress. So you know what? We're going to put a list on screen right now with the list of advancements that we're going to try and complete this episode. Some range from simple stuff as hitting a block from 30 blocks away. And some others are a bit more difficult, which is jump from the top of the world to the very bottom and survive with a bucket of water, aka the MLG water trick. Now, there's a bit of a, 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 a hitch with that one is if I die in this world that I'm on right now, as you can see the hardcore hearts well that's actually a texture pack it's not a hardcore world but if i die um one of you guys gets uh, 500 dollars because i died so if you're not subscribed make sure you subscribe and turn on your notification bell um and leave a like rating because i'm gonna need all the love and support i can possibly get now it's worth noting that that's gonna be the most difficult achievement that we're gonna try and complete today however the first one on the list is gonna be the bullseye one which is Hit a target block from 30 blocks away. Um, and if it wasn't for Google, I would have no idea how to make this thing. But just as a public service announcement, um, I didn't have this like recipe unlocked until I learned from Google that you need a hay block, some redstone dust around it, and you can make a target block, which we're going to try and hit now. And I'm going to spice things up just a little bit more. Now, we could do this the simple way, which is um, my beautiful melon pumpkin farm is 30 blocks long, and I could just simply fire an arrow at the block that you can see at the end probably wouldn't miss it and i'm all for that because it's an easy way to uh, you know get an advancement done but no 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 we're gonna spice this up with a block that i have placed over here you'll see it here on the edge because i'm going to try and shoot from here okay up to the bottom of the ufo portal that we've made and hit this first time now Look at me in the face right now. I don't know why I'm on this whole thing of like, oh, give stuff away to the viewers because 99% of the time you guys just roast me in the comments. So go ahead, roast me now, leave a comment because for every shot that I miss and don't get this achievement, right? I'm going to be giving away a Razer headset to one lucky person who's left a comment and subscribes. So prepare yourselves because... I may end up giving a lot away here. I I'm used to doing this on my live stream. So, uh, <laughs> yeah, let's uh, see how this goes. But if I can somehow hit this first time round, then I am wi a wizard. I would actually say I get a practice shot with this. But you know what? That would be cheating. Now, we've got to calculate this. We've got to understand where this is going. I'm thinking that we should aim about here and we should nail it. Do I need to raise it a little bit more? Maybe to the tippy top of it? I think this is going to be a good shot. Are you guys ready? In three? Two, one, let him fly. <gasps> that was actually so unbelievably close. Wait, so, yeah. So that, that means I've got to give away one Razer headset to one lucky viewer. So if you're not leaving a comment right now, you should be doing because someone's going to win a Razer headset. That was actually mad close, by the way. Can we all agree? Okay, second shot. I'm thinking this is going to nail it. I think, I'm thinking this is going to nail it. <gasps> How? Okay, okay, right, we, we, may, we may need to, we may need to reevaluate how we're doing this. That is two Razer headsets I've now got to give away. Okay, I'm going to go a little bit higher now, maybe to about there. All right, let's try this shot. Are we ready? I'm feeling confident. I'm fire. I hit it. I, <laughs> I, I, I hit, I hit it. What do you mean? What do you mean? Where's my, <laughs> where's my advancement? Hit the bullseye of a target block from at least 30 meters away. Wait, are you t are you telling me? Oh no, nah 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 nah. Are you are you telling me that that doesn't actually class as a bullseye? That's no no, I didn't sign up for this. That, that is okay, it's maybe not a bullseye, but come on! There's there's no way I have to give away an extra an extra one. I hit the block. I thought the rules hit the block. Nah, I'm being be, be absolutely shenanigans right now. Like, it's orange. This is luck-based, this. This makes no sense. So if I'm right saying, is, 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 is it about there that I need to aim? Am I, am I about to miss again? Are you ready? All right, let's, let's give it a fire from here. All right, are we going to hit it? <gasps> You're joking me! I hit the... I somehow... If you look at that, I somehow hit the underneath of the block. How how far away am I from this? I'm on... I'm on 330... Wait, wait. Hang on a minute. 
Oh, hang on a minute. Is it not even 30 blocks away? 330? Wait, no. No, it's more than 330 blocks away. It, it's more than 30 blocks away. You're kidding me. Wait, wait. How did I... How did I physically get an arrow to hit the bottom of it? That makes no sense. I've got nothing left. I've got nothing left. All right, so uh, it's dead simple. It's really simple. This All I've got to do is hit the bullseye. Just hit the bullseye with an arrow. Boom, like that. Ooh. That's on it. That's on it. Nah, nah, nah. Cut this out. Cut this, cut this out right now. This was supposed to be simple. Why, why have I signed up to this? This was supposed to be a simple, simple task. I was supposed to just buy the arrow, hit the block. No, and I'm getting rolled up on it at the same time. You need to know your place, man. Okay, so, right, right, right. All I gotta do, all I gotta do is just hit the bullseye. That's all I've gotta do. I gotta aim just below. This is terrifying. I've just gotta aim just below it. And everything will be everything will be okay. Nah, nah, you know, I I don't believe this is working. I I've got a, it's got to be a bug. This is going to be a good. But let me go to my testing world just to see if this is even doable. Okay, so I've been away and I've done some mathematics of how I need to shoot at this block to make this work and make this happen. I am not going to fail now. Are you ready? In three, two. One, let it rip. Oh dear, oh dear, that's just... Oh! oh, oh! <laughs> now, you might be wondering... <laughs> uh, how did that work? Now, <laughs> thanks, thanks to the power of the internet, I did some Googling to work out what the best way to complete this challenge was. And you might go, but Tom, you were nowhere near that block. But if you would notice, like, I feel like this is, you know, like in the films where they break down the bank heist scene. Um, do you know what? I'll actually give you guys another headset for me missing that one. How, how many headsets in total? Well, yeah, I went away and I Googled like th this thing and it turns out you do genuinely have to hit the bullseye. So um, I made... I made this contraption, which goes all the way down to the end over here, which if you follow it and follow it and follow it, I had climbed up this wooden staircase, fired an arrow directly on the middle of the bullseye, and then when I triggered the redstone, it opens it up and the arrow falls dead on the bull. Ladies and gentlemen, your boy's got brains! I would, I would also like to point out that your, boy, your boy's bankrupt because um, that, that that kind of joke of like giving a headset away for every single one was pro was probably supposed to like be like one headset or two headset. And it, it ended up being a bit more than that. So um, smash like, rate, and leave a comment because I'm going to be giving away that many headsets. I don't even know what the count is at right now, but I think it might be like five or something. So, uh, <laughs> all right. Well, at least we've completed that advancement so we can tick that off the list right now and we can move on to something which should be a lot Easy. Oh my gosh, what is going on? Oh, wait a minute. I can, I almost forgot about my automatic pumpkin farm. How many have we gathered? <gasps> Whoa! Yo, this thing's been busy. Since since the day we've made it, we've got nearly, uh, nearly three full stacks. Let me just show you how easily it is to just go over here and grab yourself an actual uh, full stack. So, oh, wait, is it actually a full stack or is it just less than? I have no idea. But uh, we're going to need a, a, full, a full stack. Uh, but we're going to need pumpkins because for our next advancement on the list, we're going to create ourselves an iron golem. That's right. We are, we are, we are. So I'm hoping that I've st Do I have any in here left over? No. And oh, yes. Thank you very much. All right. So we need to make some blocks. We got our iron. Uh, we got our uh, iron that we need. And we need to decide where we're going to put him. Now, I do believe if you actually go in, summon an iron golem to help defend a village. I'm thinking that this, this achievement and advancement actually can only be done when you're actually having a village being attacked. So we may have, I may not be able to achieve this one just yet. We might have to go and find a village and then have to protect it from like, you know, like a, a, from, a, from, a, from a siege. But wait a minute, isn't there an achievement for villages and lightning runs? One sec, let me just scroll through. <gasps> protect a villager from an undesired shock without, without starting a fire. Now I wonder, could we actually, could we actually try and sort this out right now? I right, go ahead and make a lightning rod here. Actually, let's make a, let's let's make let's let's make a few lightning rods. All right, so we've got five lightning rods here. I'm not gonna sleep the night, but what I'm actually gonna do. Oh, man, that every, everything is being struck to the living hell. 
Now, we could easily just go up there and uh, try and complete this. But I think we could rely on our home slice who's hiding inside here. If I'm right in saying, aha, I do indeed have a villager who chills under here and sells beds. Now, if I get rid of this real fast, like so, plonk that down and release him. Release the Kraken. You're free. I don't understand why you're not like running away uh, in a mad panic. Come on now. I'll, pl I'll play ball, man. Right, it's always one difficult guy. Get out of there. Right, yeah, go towards, go towards the, oh my God. Right, okay, one sec. Try this one again. You know what? You won't have a bloody job in a minute. I'll, I'll, I'll take that from you. Okay. Bang. bang. Okay. No, this is not. Sure. Get it. Thank you. All right. Is it still raining and lightning? It is. It is. It is. It is. All right. So what I'm thinking is could I place him like here? Oh, I don't think lightning can strike there one set. Let's go, let's go to a bit more of an open set of land. So perhaps over here. All right. If I put this here like so and then just... Put a bunch of lightning rods near him. Um, is this going to... Ah! <laughs> what was that? <laughs> what have I done? <laughs> what have I done? <laughs> what on earth was that? Oh, well, that didn't work. I, I, um, I can't quite say <laughs> I was expecting that. Um, so that's how you make a witch? Don't piss and laugh at me, all right? I'll just crack your head in. Come on, then. Come on, then. Let's go right now. Um, so, I had no idea that was a thing. Wow, me, me trying to complete this achievement list is uh, bloody hilarious. Imagine me trying to speed run this. This would be absolutely brilliant. Uh, I'm going to be right. So, if I've still got... I've, I've now lost a villager, by the way. Let's try and see if I can go put a lightning rod up near where we've got our existing villagers. Um, and see if that works and helps. Because that... Sure as shit didn't. I tell you something. This is this is hands down my favorite let's play I've ever done. I just think it's so hilarious how things go wrong all the time. Now I'm gonna try and place one there. I'm gonna place like one there. I'll place like one there. Um, I'll pl wait. It's not it's not like getting status. <laughs> Whoa! What the hell was that? Sorry, I am jumpy for some reason right now, and I don't know why. I'm gonna place one there. Does it like does it need to be placed on the ground like there? Oh, maybe it has to be placed on the ground. Hmm. So these don't seem to be I'm scared of that now. These don't seem to be doing anything because they're not getting like the staticky electricity from it. Um, do I need some mud? I perhaps think I might need some mud. So give me some of this. Okay. Now can I can I like 200 IQ this like so? So we've got this dude here. Can I put like this here? Will this work? Is that getting staticky? Oh. Um. Not really. Was the lightning passed? Oh, no. I think... Oh, no. The storm stuff. I should really do some Googling of how to do this because I'm sure this is a really e easy advancement and achievement to get, but I have no damn clue. I have no damn clue how to do this. I've got a bunch of lightning rods around the place, but none of them are shining tingling except that one. Uh, uh, I have no idea. Now, I've noticed they have to be open to the elements like this one is now. This is actually being rained upon, so it's got like a bit of a charge appearing inside it. And so is this one. I think as you, if you look at that one. Oh, 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 yes! Surge protector! Your boy did it! Oh, that was brilliant. So the one I placed for this guy was actually underneath these blocks, whereas this one is just out to the side. I'm a wizard. I'm the best. I'm sleeping. Victory. And oh, yeah, this guy managed to escape. So, uh, you know, it just kind of is what it is. Surge protector. Protect a villager from an undesired shock. Um, I know that wasn't on the list of things to do, but like, let's open the list. Let's like move the list down, put that one in and then tick it off. Great success. Now, I just want to check that I'm actually not being an idiot and I can actually protect a village by placing this down. So if I actually just build this now, could I possibly get the achievement for this? Is like, is that, wait, why is that not working? Is the bed in the way? Wait, what? Why did that not just build an iron? Go oh, wait, don't I need to make... Ah, uh, anyway, I think I need to... Don't I need to shear the pumpkin head? I think I might have been... I think I'm... Luckily, use my brain there. Right, let's pull that back. Oh, wait, it's already there. Yes! Oh, brilliant! You're right! I'm gonna call you... Um... I, 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 I'm gonna call you... Uh, chat, what... Guys, what am I gonna call him? Leave a comment down below. We'll try and keep this guy along for as much as possible. Um, uh, just a word of warning. Um, if you don't do your job properly... Um, you're going to end up like um, your boy here who's just chilling to his immediate death. And uh, I, I jumped then and didn't know whether I was wearing all my armor and my boots. But yeah, if you end up failing, mate, you'll end up hanging out like um, Hangman Harry here. Yeah, someone leave a comment down below and we'll get a name tag and we'll name that guy. But a uh, 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 list of things to do.
Take that bad boy off. Now, as it be, it's kind of convenient that we're stood near the cow farm. Now, you were the one that was supposed to escape and be freed, which I might actually let you live. One sec. Can I kill this guy and potentially get his boots off him? Come here, you. If you if you drop boots... <gasps> this is this episode is meant to be. This is me... It's got one durability left. This is it. This Guys, this is the Pog episode. This is the episode of progression you guys have always wanted. Smash like rating right now. Subscribe. Ding dong notification bell. Go to Syndicate Original. Get yourself some swagger. That's exactly what we needed. You might be like, well, what? To get the next advancement that we needed, which is light as a rabbit, you need leather boots and then to walk on powdered snow. And we know where to find the powdered snow. We just needed the leather boots. I was going to kill that cow for it. But it turns out that skeleton dropped exactly what we needed. So that is a great success. So let's head all the way off into the distance where we know the powdered snow is. We'll even take the boat with us just in the off chance we can uh, find a goat around there because I believe they spawn in that area. And then we can try and complete the whatever floats your goat challenge as well. So uh, let's keep rocking. I, I would just like everyone to put an F in the chat, by the way, for this poor B, because I, I stole his home a few, a few, I say a few episodes back, it was a l good long amount of episodes back. I stole his home, and he's, he's got nowhere to go. I would like, oh, do you know what? Um, do you know what? We could actually be very, very smart, because you see how many bees there are around here. If we can get all the bees into, wait, they can't get to their home. Wait, are they actually, oh wait, could they? No, I don't think they could. Wait, if I open this up, wait a minute, is this going to backfire on me? But if I do this, for example, and just reveal this, this beehive, because there's an advancement for getting three bees in one hive. Where is it? It's, uh, is it this one? Nope, it is not that one. I'm assuming it looks like honeybug. Where, where is it? Is it in husband? Ah, there you go. Move a bee nest with three bees inside it using silk touch. Now, as you can see, one, two, and three uh, are just chilling and getting about. Uh, maybe we could perhaps bring some flowers over it and incentivize them all to get inside it. Hmm, that'd be quite good. Oh, wait, is he going up? Right, one sec. Are you going in? He's go I think he's going in. Go in a day. Go in a day. Go in a day. He's not doing it. Do not fear! Flower Man Tommy's here! And oh, look at it! There's actually four bees! Do you know what? This would actually be really good for us for us making our, our beehive. So I think if I place these down. Oh, wait, yeah, yeah, yeah. See, look, they're all attracted to it. So if I put that one there and like bring him in. Oh, there you go. I've got an army of bees. Oh, oh, this is great. Right, and I place these guys down. Will they all manage? One. There's one. Okay. Are you go. Are you guys gonna do do the? Do, are you guys doing the thing? Do, do the thing and then get inside, perhaps. Do do the thing and then get inside. We've got one. You're you're going the wrong way. You are supposed to fund all the flowers and get inside the house. What even is this? <gasps> Oh, 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 get in, get in, get in, get in. Wait, is it full? Yes! Total bee location! Yes! Oh, okay, that is wicked. So I'm assuming you can only maybe get three bees in one. That, that seems like a full hive to me, but another advancement completed. <coughs> Ticket off the list. Your boy has managed to make poggers progress this episode. <laughs> so, look at this. It's a little, it's a little rabbit. You, 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 might, you might be wondering why, why I killed that, but I'm pretty sure it's, there's an achievement for, like, kill one of every single animal, no matter what. So, I did it. I slayed it. I'm a bad guy. Fight. Fight me. All right? Um, now, ah! This! I think this I think this is it. As I'm, I'm being chased by a witch. Can you... Stop. I don't want to hit... Oh, what? Damn. She, she, she nailed that. Damn, she absolutely nailed that. Can I hit that creeper from here? You're it. Right. <laughs> Maybe not. As we all know, I'm pretty bad with arrow shots. Okay. So let's switch over to our leather boots and walk on this. Light as a rabbit. Tick it off. Your boy's a wizard. Okay, now if I take them off, do I just fall straight through it? Oh, I do. Hi, right, mate. Oh, look at you wearing all your uh, leather armor. Oh, look, light as a rabbit, you. Okay, that's pretty good. So we've got that one. The next thing we'd have to do whilst we're up here is either find a tree so we can sleep and skip the night, but is also to keep our eyes. Uh, oh, I, I tell you what, I'm going to need you. Come here. No, come, come, come back. Come, 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 come. Come, come, come. Come, 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 come. I need, the, I need your balls. Oh, watch out. <laughs> your balls are under attack. I don't, come here. Yeah, there we go. We need some more ender pills. Because when we're going to fight that ender dragon, I'm going to need some ender eyes to get about with. But, uh, oh, hello. Is that a snow bunny rabbit? I'm going to kill you. Oh, there's multiple. Wait, how do you breed a, a snow bunny rabbit? Is it seeds? I actually have no idea. It would, be, it would be quite good to know, but I don't know. Anyway, right, let me just quickly chop a tree and uh, skip the night over here. Because this, this is hella dark, man. No way. Okay, okay. So this might be really, 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 really good. If these rabbits are still about here, it's said you can breed them with carrots 
or golden carrots, uh, which I did not think it would like you did. There you go, there's a rabbit. So when I've got them in my hand, will they be interested? They will be interested. Ah, uh, rabbit, save me, I'm sick egg. Rabbit, save me, I'm sick egg. Oh, bollocks, oh, one sec. Rabbit, you're doing a really bad job of saving my life. Okay, there we go, two rabbits. Here you go, here you go. Oh my God, why do you look like you're just about to kill everything? There's one. Wait, where did the other one just go? Oh, there you go, here you go, here you go. Here we go, two. All right, now get your, are you guys, are you guys of age? <gasps> you are! Oh, look at him! Hello, there's a few. Oh, oh, you, oh, you're a hungry bastard. Okay, well, there we go. We've, we've done rabbits. We've bred rabbits. That's great. Okay, so so there's one luckily for... Oh, fuck it. I'm sinking. I'm sinking. <laughs> Get me out of it. I should really just put the leather boots back on and then I'd be able to traverse all this. No problem, but, you know, just that's that's just Tom things. I'm awkward. It's the way I like doing it. Uh, nope. Okay, let's not sink down. There. Now, let's play um, I Spy Goat Edition. Oh, shit. Oh, okay. Okay. I'm probably dead. Stop. Stop. Just stop. Let me out. Let me out. Let me out. Okay. I spy goat edition. We're, we're on the hunt. There. I s oh, there's two goats. There's two goats. Whatever floats your goat, I'm coming for you. <laughs> Ooh, just look at this. I found, some, I found some wolves along the way. It would actually be quite nice to uh, tame one of them and take them back for... Uh, uh, wait, what's my dog called again? Is it Bruno? I think, I think it's Bruno. <laughs> I took so long, like, not paying that do uh, that dog any attention. I can't quite remember. But, all right, I'm here. Um, uh, goats, don't attack. Let's be friends. Because one of you... Oh, oh what the f heck? They're doing, they're doing goat parkour. All right, one of you is getting in this boat. I don't know which one of you it is. But it oh, yes! Whatever flows your goat. Quick, take a picture. Nice! All right, there you go. I absolutely nailed that. Oh, I might, I might just leave it. <laughs> I might just leave a minute. I know it's a little bit mean, but... Whatever floats your goat, achievement completed. We're smashing it. We're absolutely smashing it. Whoa. Hang on a minute. Who the heck is underneath me? Why can I hear like a hundred monsters? <gasps> no way! That, as, as if! I, I, as if! So that's the mountain I've just come spelunking down and I was just going to run all the way home and just say... Oh, wait, hang on a minute. Let's get him to blow up. He'll kill them all. Watch. Watch multi-kill, 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 multi-kill. Oh, wait, what? You're kidding me. That would absolutely have destroyed me if I wasn't wearing armor. You cannot write this. So I was just going to spelunk all the way home and then get on with our next achievement, which is, is it's a bird? So I've got to run all the way home. And once we get to home, we then got to get the, uh, the, the spyglass and then head out to the jungle biome again that we found in the previous episode. But just from hearing that noise then, your boy's only got and found himself a zombie spawner. Hello, boss. I'm home, daddy. Right, now we don't actually need this because we've got one, but what treats inside have we found? So, we've got some golden horse armor. Eh, not the best, not the worst. You know, it's it's something to add to our collection, but can we please find something cool in here? No. Uh, <laughs> no is the, is, the, is the top and bottom of it. I'll take, a, I'll take a screenshot of the coordinates as to where it is, just for the future reference, but uh, it's nice to find... It's just sad that we don't simply need it. We're at a point where we've already got one. We actually got mad lucky, if you think about it, that the actual spawn that we found is super close to the house. Now, the reason why I actually started recording in the first place wasn't actually because of the, um, the, the zombie sounds that I heard then. The reason why I started recording was there is a technique that you can do is when you see, like, just a rogue tree in the wild, that can sometimes be an azalea tree. And if you dig right down below it, it opens you up into the lush caves. Now, I was going to say, is this a rogue, tr uh, like, azalea tree? I think the way for me to find out whether or not it's true or not is to use my silky axe on this and let me know what this is made out of. Okay, so it's just oak leaves, not azalea. Because I was going to say, if this, is, uh, if this is an azalea tree, we should dig all the way down and try and find it. But, uh, spoiler alert, turns out it's not. However, through starting recording, I found a zombie spawner. W. Now, I know the route to get me home is to run in a straight line that way. But I have just discovered that I can uh, tiptoe over, over in this direction somewhere where I've never been before. So I might as well load that up. But I could take a little nap here before I run over in that direction and see if there's anything new that we can find over the yonder, because that biome over there looks like it might load up pretty damn saucy. Ooh, what is this? I don't, I don't know whether this is leading to something, but this is very, like, naturally eerie. Just happened to find a load of just, like, cobblestone, like, looking all cool. And that definitely looks like it says danger all over it, but is this is this going to lead me to anything? Kind of looks like I'm going to find, like, a, a jungle temple or something, but 
I think it just made me blocks of mossy cobblestone scattered all over the place. I very much do like it. I would be harvesting this all up, by the way, like picking it all up. But um, the fact that you can make this stuff. Oh, what is that? <gasps> Foxes. Oh, I didn't even. Th How do I breed foxes? I, I, I would have never guessed this, but you need to use sweet berries, which I do believe grow in this biome. I could be very wrong, but I'm, I'm just assuming and think that they do. So if we have a bit of a run round here, try and find a berry bush, collect some. I've got bone meal, so I should be able to grow some. And if, if we actually take a berry bush with us and eat one, we can tick off our other list. But do we have? Any berry bushes around here? Can you see any from up here? Wait a minute, I have actually found something. I've legitimately found something. What on earth is that? Is this a, t a t uh, what? Okay, oh, a cat. Oh, I should, I should try and breed that because I need to tame all the cats. Oh, whoa, is this an abandoned village or something? But I, I, I'm going with the abandoned village thing because of the cobwebs and stuff, but whoa. I didn't know these were a thing. And oh, Sweet berry bushes. That is ex that's exactly what we need. Now, can I actually grow these how I think I can? I place it down, make bone meal, and then there you go. So now, I now I've got sweet berry bushes that I can farm and I can tame the foxes. What on earth is this place about? Oh, this is this is this like a completely new biome? I've never been. Bing but oh, why did I just use all those bones? We could have actually brought back another one with another dog with us. Bruno would have been so happy. Whoa. Wow, this is wicked. I've never... Oh, yeah, mate. Are you just stuck in there? I think you are. <laughs> wow, this is sick. Oh, yeah, I've, I've never... I don't think I've ever come across one of these. I know it's something so simple, but... Yeah, how cool. And uh, we found ourselves yet another bit of an upgrade in our Minecraft world. Anything in here? Just a bed. And uh, I would take this, but I've got about 9,000 bells at home. So I'm just going to leave this being leave behind. Worth checking if there's any loot anywhere along here. Is there anything in here? Uh, this would be this would be a good start. If you found this at the start of the game, mate, you'd be rocking. Hey, look at that. Cartographer, compass, an empty map. Oh, should I fill it out? Can I just right-click this? There you go. Oh, this, this is kind of cool. Uh, I'm going to put that back for the next traveler who finds it. Stained glass and all sorts. There we go. Cartographer's house. Very nice. And then, oh, yeah, look. Told you all the bushes did actually spawn in here. Oh, I like this. Oh, this is a nice setup. Has it got like a chimney? Oh, it's got a chimney as well. Yo, whichever villager... Oh, they're all dead. <laughs> Rip, uh, but whichever villager built it, uh, it, you've done a very nice job. I'm oh, shit. Let's get the hell out of me. I was not, expe <laughs> not, not expecting that sound effect then. Ah, stop it. Uh, I was not expecting that, but yeah, this is cool. All right, foxes, where you at? You're getting bread. I'm ticking it off my list, and we are continuing our road to 100%ness. I think if, I, if I'm right in saying, all I've got to do is like just loop back up this hill. I'm just a little bit worried that that fox is a baby fox and he's not fully grown yet. So I don't think I'll be able to breed him, but hopefully we can find another one. Fingers crossed. Ooh. Wow. Wow. I could, I could not click record fast enough then. Um, so it turns out there was a big hole in the ground as I was looking at my RuneScape game and I've fallen down a random hole, which as would you know it, Oh, yes, take some bones. We'll actually be able to breed the dogs. Hell yeah. Not that. Yeah. I've fallen into a lush cave. That's so sick. Hey! Now, is, uh, is, it, is it actually a thing? We found one of these before, right? I, bl I believe we have. Now, I think I'm right in saying that inside a lush cave in these waters, you can find... Uh, is it axolots? Ocelots? Ax uh, exo uh, I keep saying it wrong, apparently. But apparently, you can find an os. I think it's an ocelot. No, it's not an ocelot. It's an axel. What, what is it called? There. Ax axolotl. There you go. Nailed it. Axolotl. You can find. Oh, I thought that was it. Apparently, there's an achievement or something to find, like, it's either an axolotl or a blue axolotl. Catch, an axel catch the cutest predator. So we've got to keep our eyes peeled and maybe we can tick off yet another achievement when wandering around in here. It's a big old area, so fingers crossed. Uh, and you know what? I'm actually going to kill you because. I need you for my signs. I need you for my signs in the video. So if you guys haven't left a comment yet on the on the video, make sure you do because you never know. You might get a shout out. Now they floated to the surface. Let's collect them and uh, get some torches, mate, because it's too damn dark. Luckily, I'm all about stocking up on resources along the way. 64 torches in my pocket. I'm ready for some exploring and... Whoa. Whoa. Yeah. Oh, wait, there's one. 
Let's enact them all. All right, uh, uh, F3, screenshot these coordinates. I may actually not clear this place out because, you know, there's a lot of clay that we can pick up here. I may actually not clear this place out and instead uh, make a portal to be able to get us over here. Well, I'm looking forward to making the, the nether transport system. I've just not got around to doing it yet. Now, I have a bucket with water in. But you, you need. To I'm going to hit you with a spade for some reason. Okay, I'll hit you with it. You can't reach. <laughs> it's too small. It's so little and cute. Is he dead? Oh, is he dead? Oh, he's not his he's friends. He's not his friends. Get away from me. All right, where's my axe? Give me that. Nope. 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 Let me alone. Let me alone. Let me alone. Listen, I'm, I, I'm, I'm, I'm not a poacher, but I'm kind of a poacher. Now, where have those... Uh, axolotls. Oh, there they are. I can see them swimming. All right, let me switch this around for that. My inventory is an absolute mess. I don't care what you say. All right, let's put that down. Let's put this down. And hey! All right, axolotl, get get him. Get in the book. Get in the book. Yes! Advancements have been made. Uh, the cutest predator. Look at that. All right. Now, I would like to take that, but can you breed these guys? Because if we can, we might as well do that now, but uh, I have no idea what they need to breed again. So, would you believe it? I'm going to Google. Oh, all right. So these guys are exactly the easiest thing to breed. Uh, to do it, you need two buckets of tropical fish. So yeah, not exactly something I can just whip out real quick right now. Oh, okay. Is someone at Why are you archering me from over there? Just stop. Just stop it. Stop. Know what you've done is wrong. I'm going to kill you. I need your balls. All right. They're going in my pocket. Where are your balls? They didn't go in my pocket. That is just... just wait a minute. Wait a gosh damn second. I've actually got an idea. You guys may be very impressed with me right now. As long as this one's still here, let me put that back down. Am I right in saying if I open this up? No! I moved them. I had buckets of tropical fish just chilling in here for when we were going to make our aquarium. But I must have took them out when I was organizing during the in-between of the episodes. Oh, that is such a shame. And why did that squeak just sound like one of them died? I don't know. I, I can't, listen, I can't trust you dying. So I'm going to, I'm going to, come here. I'm going to pick you back up. All right. And then I'm actually going to get the other one. And I'm going to put you guys inside this. All right. There you go. I'm gonna put you in there. And I'm going to put you in there, you in there, you in there. Some of my riches. We'll put the pumpkins in there. Cauldrons, coal, everything else that we need. And luckily, yes. Go like that. Let's take this. A crafting table. We're going to put this down. And we are going to make a bucket. And pick that up, that up, and we're taking you with us. There we go. So we can take them home and get them bread. I am, I am a bloody efficient player. I, like if I may blow my own trumpet, I am an efficient player. I'm a bit of a potato 99% of the time, but, you know, we, 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 we take them uh, in strides. Got to showcase this real quick. Hang on a minute. Don't kill him, don't kill him, don't kill me. Oh, that's a bit of a shame. Oh, I think I've just managed to get myself a disc. And is it one I've already got? I've got a feeling it might be. Oh, mal. A mall. I think I've already got that one, unfortunately. But, uh, yeah, I'm just running around clearing out this uh, canyon real quick. And uh, I think I may have exhausted everything I need from it. Got a good amount of resources, good amount of redstone. And uh, got a, a good amount of arrows put into the side of my face. So, uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's go ahead and get up to the surface. I genuinely thought that this moss block was part of the actual scenery of, like, the mossy area. But it turns out it is not because I've just managed to bag myself a good amount of stacks of uh, some clay. I thought I might as well take it as we're here. And look what your boys found! A spider spawner! Now, I don't know if you can actually make any uh, like good spider spawners from this. But like I said, go ahead and screenshot this. Because when we make our nether highway, we can actually make a, a roadmap to get over to this. And we found a disc called 13, which... I'm throwing it out there. I am not 100% sure we've had that one yet. So that's a win. Can we take the gold? I think we'll just leave the gold. And inside here, two new saddles. I think... Whoa, chill here, chill here, chill here. Let me go, go ahead and plug this up real quick. Thank you, thank you. Uh, if we go ahead, that is a great success. So if I take this, plonk you on down, what's in here that we don't really need or we could do without? Okay, I tell you what, let's be smart. Let's compact everything into blocks. So like redstone blocks, all that sort of stuff will be sorted. Don't really need these. Uh, if I've got any extra stacks of things, I don't need it. We can, we can, we can condense. We can condense. Oh, this cave system's got even bigger and has exposed all the mine shaft system. But I've also found above me more. Da oh no! Wait, you are joking me. You are actually joking me. What I've just found now. What are the? 
What are the chances that I would find diamonds and have a reason to look up and have found... I have no idea what kind of spawner that is. I'm going to guess it's zombie because that's why there's so many like zombies running around. But uh, it could be skeleton. I have no idea. Like, that's crazy. Like the actual chances of that are astronomical. The fact that I've just found two chests as well looking up. Oh my gosh. I've not even looked around this area, which I'm excited to do because there could be chests everywhere. But uh, just go ahead and eat and then just build straight up. I think that's going to be a winner. I'm guessing it's going to be zombie. What is it? Oh no, it's a skeleton. Here we go. Inside here. A name tag. That's great. Yeah, we'll take a name tag. Thank you. Uh, let's get rid of that. We'll take another saddle. Sure thing. Drop that off. Loyalty three. We could end up using that in the future, but I don't really need it. I'm going to leave behind the flint. And inside this one, we've got another CD. Oh, 13. So we have actually already got that before. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to leave that then because if I've already got one, do I really need a spare? Actually, maybe for maybe for display purposes. Let's take it. Let's take it. Um, And I guess... Um, Wait. Have I... I haven't found a, spy, a, a skeleton spawner before, right? So for unlimited bone meal and everything like that, that this is a win. Wait, let, let's make sure I found the, the zombie one near us. We've just found a spider one, and this is a skeleton one. Yeah, I think this class this class is something new on our unlock list. And there's another, there's yet another spider spawner over there. What on earth, man? This is just stupid. This area is absolutely ridiculous. Hmm, I have managed to find myself another am amethyst shard. So let's go ahead and screenshot this. It's always worth knowing where everything is in my little world, but. So, whoa, that's a big cluster up there. Uh, something good about this that we're here is if we actually ditch some things, let's say we're going to ditch. We're going we're gonna, to... We're gonna I don't want to ditch anything. Right, let's ditch. What is the most valuable thing? Right, the, the cobbled deep slide, right? We're going to ditch that. If I break this, I should get the shard. But then how do I make the spy... No, is it not called glass? Looking glass. Wait, what? Oh, I think... I, do I need a crafting table? I think I need a crafting table. That. Let me do this. Throw that down. Throw that here because we can actually be much smarter because we actually needed to go home just so we can make the spyglass. Whereas maybe I might not have to do that spyglass. What do I need? <gasps> Wait, hang a minute. Inside here, am I right in saying? Do I actually have some copper? Yes. Oh, that is that is an absolute win. What what are the chances that I would I would happen to have that on me? Okay, so we have got the spyglass. Uh, we have got spare amethyst shards. Uh, I've just got too much good stuff that I don't know what to do with. All right, let's make that into that. Beautiful. Give me, give me this. Get rid of that. Put that in there. Uh, I've got too much stuff. First world problems. Whoa, this is easily the most shards I've ever found inside a cave at once. Like, look at the size of some of these ones. Absolutely gigantic. 55! 55 shards! Is this fully grown? I guess so. 55 shards! Wow, that is ridiculous. 64 shards! Wow, are you fully grown? You're gonna max me out 64? Max me out 64. Right, um, I, I, I am very much at a point now uh, where I think I'm good. You know what I mean? Like, I think we can just run off. Uh, where's, where's my carrots? I think we can run off to the distance um, of, you know, the jungle area. So let's get up top now, no matter what. No matter what, we're going to the surface, all right? And then let's run along and try and see if we can head towards the jungle biome that we previously found and spy on a parrot to get the is it a bird achievement completed. As far as adventures go, that was well worth discovering. I can't, I, I, I can't even remember why we went in there in the first. Oh wait, oh wait, I may have, I may have had a blunder. I'm pretty sure the reason why we fell in there in the first place is because we were looking for the foxes because we needed the sweet berries to breed them. But if you have a look at my inventory, I don't have the sweet berries. So I'm now going to have to go back to the village, find more sweet berries, then find the foxes, and then breed them. All right. <gasps> Wait, I can actually do it. Would you like to come with me? I've got, I've got, right, listen, you are, I'm going to say, let me have a look. You're a, you're a woman dog. You're coming with me. Hurrah, huzzah. He's so excited. You can come with me and um, you can become best friends with Bruno. Uh, and, th and then, oh, <gasps> they can have puppies. And then, there you go. There's another breeding achievement complete. It's like everything I do actually has reason and has purpose. Now, I am going to need to get... Oh, wait. As soon as I bred you now, I don't need that. You don't want that, right? No, good. Okay. Right, now I need to take these. Thank you. 
and then we need to run back up on the hill. Whatever you do, do not eat the foxes when we get there, all right? I need them. What do we do with a drunken sailor? What do we do with a drunken sailor? What do we do with a drunken sailor early in the morning? That should be a song that I'm singing when I'm in a ship riding towards uh, the jungle biome. I would very much still like to go home and drop off all my stuff, but um, we're that close to the jungle biome that we might as well just adventure over to it. Now, this is as far as I made it last time before I fell down into that. So let's go round that this time without falling in. And hopes we find the foxes. Hello? What kind of fox? What does the noise does that? Wait, I was going to say. Oh, no. I just remembered. Does anyone remember that song? What does a fox say? And then it goes like, meow, 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 meow. Like the weirdest one in the world. Well, yeah, that one. Okay, now, do you guys want to breed with this? Wait, how do I? Do you guys not want? Wait, this is what you guys breed with. Why are you running? I'm so confused. You, yeah, you should be coming towards me. What the hell's in your mouth? Are they whiskers? There you go. Uh, well, he's horny. We just need the other guy to come back. Uh, okay. Oh my. Oh my gosh. He's gone. He's he's gone. Hello. I can hear you on the other side of this. No. 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 Come back. Stop running. Stop running. Stop running. Right. No. Stop running. What are you doing? You can stay still. You're like a pissed off cat. I'm gonna get you. Okay. So I've got them both to eat it. I just now need them to, to touch tips. Are they, are they getting close to each other? No, why? You're going down into where I just came out of. Don't do that. But it, what What the hell? He's picked up a block and run off with it, the daft git. Oh my god, this is a nightmare. This is an actual nightmare. How do I get, how do I get them to follow me? I don't understand. What is going on? <sighs> I'm gonna go bald! So this fox is all the way down this hill, and the other fox is on the other side of that hill. Please, how do I get you to follow me? Do I do I slowly tame you with this, or like, will you actually come to me with it? Come on. Do I throw one? Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. I, I have no. <gasps> Two hundred IQ. We can use boats. Wait. Did they just do it? Did they just do the thing? No, 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 chill, 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 Are you coming towards me? Okay. Right, where's the other one gone? Come on. Are you, uh, like, I... Wait, he sat still. I need him to come down. I need him to come down from up there. Come on. Wait, why have you come to me all of a sudden? Boat. I need to get him in a boat. <gasps> Shit. Like, if I stand still and look at him, <gasps> No, 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 yes, 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 <gasps> Oh my god, you annoying bastards. You actual annoying bastards. Get in now. Nah, that's it. I'm gonna eat you. I'm gonna kill you. I'm gonna see what comes out of you. I'm gonna eat you. I don't care. Right, what, what dropped? What dropped? N nothing. All of that for nothing. I've chased you round and round the houses for nothing. At least we got them to breed, okay? My gosh, that was probably one of the most infuriating things I've actually tried to do in this advancement progression list, like, so far. Like, that that was not fun. I don't care what anyone says. And you know what? It'll grow up. That's fine. But if I go to this, eat a diet, that was on 16. Now it's on 17. Oh, yeah! Now I'm not forgetting my new doggy, which is going to need a name, by the way. So if someone wants to leave some suggestions of what we're going to call our female doggy, um, let me know in the comments down below. But uh, we're now going to run, if my my memory is correct, we're going to run in this direction all the way over and over and over and over and over. And it should take us out towards the jungle biome, where I'm hoping there is indeed going to be a parrot. And if there's not a parrot, uh, we're going to have problems. Dog, you stay there. Uh, you guys. Wait, did, someone just, did someone just throw a trident on us? Why did that? He did. There's no way I'm about to get trident from this. If I get trident from this, this is the best episode I've ever recorded. Like, no cap. Give me a try to, I dare you. Well, well, um, ladies and gentlemen, uh, in the next few episodes, we can work towards, <laughs> uh, we, we, we can work towards upgrading a god tier trident. What the heck? This episode? has been absolute W after W after W. We have got so much done 
It is ridiculous. My sense of direction is incredible. Incredible, incredible, incredible. That's the village that we found the previous village on over there. So we found that, then that. Then we went and explored that, which if we run off in that direction, leads us to the jungle. Just gonna really hope, man. Just gonna really hope that in this jungle there's a parrot. I don't know if they naturally spawn there. I've got to wait there. I've got to do something, but you just gotta hope. So if we can hope that we can find a parrot, that then unlocks the uh, it's a bird achievement that's done, and then it's it's a balloon, and we can go through the previous portal that we went through, uh, and then get the next one done. This is this is just this is perfect. This is just absolutely perfect so far. Now, dog, I would take you with me, but I'm worried you might actually try and attack the parrot. So you can stay there, all right? Keep yourself nice and warm and brisk for Bruno when we get home. And we're going to explore the jungle in the massive hopes that we do indeed find ourselves a parrot. <laughs> hey, you guys. Uh, nice to see you again. Uh, I hope you've, uh, hope you've learned to stop being absolute freaks. Uh, but I highly doubt that. Uh, now, I'm going to make myself at home here. So I'm going to make myself, shocker, another crafting table. Down it goes. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and make myself some more. Uh, you know what? I might make myself just a chest. Yeah, let's make myself a chest. Just a bit of storage for now. A little bit of temporary storage. Let's go like that. Put down this bad boy. Pick up this. And I'm going to free myself just up a little bit of inventory. Because I want to... Oh. Wait, did that... Wait, was that an Easter egg? Was that an easter egg to the sneezing panda video on YouTube? Because I'm pretty sure that, that, that baby panda sneezed and the big panda jumped. <laughs> I think it was. Now, can I get you guys to breed again? I don't think you're in the hump mood. But uh, I'm going to speed your growth up as well, you little weirdo. Um, but do you know what? You're going to grow up to be an adult, so can't I kill you? Because I need to kill one of everything. I don't know. I, I, I see that as fair game. Oh, ho, ho. And luckily, this area of the jungle does indeed actually keep on going. So let's run to the very end of here, which we've not loaded up before. and We may get a parrot to spawn it. It would be interesting if I could just, like, look around like this and then just, you know, like, randomly get the achievement. Like, boom, you looked at a parrot, but I think I might have to be, like, point blank staring at it. I've, ne I've never done this one before. Let's just check Let's just check the achievement. Where is it? Where is it? Look at a parrot through a spyglass. That's all we've got to do. That is all we have to do. All we got to do is find the parrot. Um, so hopefully there's one back here. Oh my gosh, this is this is tight. Whoa! Hello, parrot, parrot. Here, oh, hey, hey, this is the parrot one. Isn't it? Here, Polly, 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 Polly. Here, Polly, 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 Polly. Oh god, another fat bastard. <gasps> I've actually found one. I've actually found one. How have I found one that's green? Are you ready? Three, two, one. Ta-da! Is it a bird which then unlocks us? Oh, wait, there's more. Oh, that, that's dangerous. <laughs> is, is it a bird? Is it a balloon? Is it a plane? Look at the ender dragon through the eyeglass. Wow. I didn't know that. Oh, actually, you know what? I might have a lot more achievements that open up if once I complete these. I didn't, I didn't realize that. I thought that would be it. Um, so now we just got to look at uh, a ghast in our next one and then do the ender dragon. Um, it would be worth seeing if we could just run around. Thank you. Wait, can't, wait, can't I tame you and you sit on my shoulder? Wait, give me some seeds. Or is it a cookie? Wait. <gasps> wait, wait, wait. I think I just damaged it. <laughs> I, I, I actually think I just damaged it. Don't I have to give it a cookie? I'm pretty sure I've got to give it a cookie. I, I think I nearly exploded that, that parrot. <laughs> that, would been, that, that would have been a really funny moment, but also really bad. How do I make cookies? Cookie. Okay, one sec. I think we need a cookie to make this parrot our friend. Let me just check a recipe. All right. I know exactly what we need. We are going to need some wheat. Oh! Now that is a great thing to just look up and find. Because I was about to say, I need wheat because I need uh, the cocoa bean. But it needs to go wheat, cocoa bean, wheat. Um, so I was about to say, we need to try and find some bone meal or just start growing some, uh, some seeds. But uh, hey, presto. Uh, that's exactly what we need. Look at that. That's a Freaking portal over there and everything. Okay, this wait, is that another parrot? There it is. Another parrot. So if we can actually make the cookies, run over to that, get them two to breed, we will have done the task at hand. So hello, village. You are coming in hella handy. Wow. Okay, yeah, this is this is stupid convenient right now. Alright, gonna take a screenshot of your coordinates, son. Boom, got you in the bag. This is looking very nice, actually. 
Very nice. This is like a beach. <laughs> this is like a beachside uh, area. We take this. Take this. Take this. And I'm hoping. One, wow, this is a big village. Damn. This is a gigantic village. Uh, I don't actually need anything from you guys apart from an enchanting room. What are you guys doing? Are you doing the thing? Are you doing the uh -huh thing? Are you doing the. Oh, cats. To be fair, we actually do need to tame cats. But I'm going to fish me right now. Uh, are you guys really going to force me to make a crafting table? Because I would very much like one of you to just have one that I can use it. Uh, but it's not looking promising on that front. Uh, how about in here? Nope. All right. Uh, well, this tree's getting it. Sorry. I don't care if this was the holy tree of uh, of the land, but it's now mine. Throw that away. Take this. Another crafting table. <laughs> uh, plunk you down. We'll take this. And we need to break that down. And like so. Bing, bing, bing. Ta-da! 64 cookies in the bag. Well, very nice to meet you guys. Uh, thanks for uh, lending me your, your, your resources. Uh, I'm going to quickly go and check what's inside this bad boy. Hello. Do you know what? We, we could also just... Oh, uh, wow. Okay, this is stupid convenient. Um, do I have any iron? No. Damn. I could do like one spare iron. That would have been sweet. Okay. Uh, oh. Oh, not like that. I was going to say, if we just combine... Oh! <gasps> Are you ready? Oh, I was going to be too drunk even use this to uh, get my uh, chest back. All right, let's get rid of this. Let's get rid of that. Uh, where has that obsidian gone? Give me you. That. That. Uh, and that's done. We now need to get this to light. So how am I going to do that? Hmm. <laughs> I've had an idea. <laughs> I shit you not. I've actually had an idea. Um, so, village, you know that I just thanked you for, uh, letting me come in here and, uh, you know, use your resources. Well, there was one last resource that I need, and I'd just like to apologize because, uh, it's exactly what I need. Now, I'm gonna get in weak, and then go in for the kill with this. No. Oh, don't you dare. Oh, don't you dare. Oh, don't you dare. Oh, you know what? No, I'm not. I'm just gonna freaking kill it. Yeet! Step it back. You're backing up right now. What? Wait, what? What? Oh, oh! <laughs> I was I was about to say there's no way I've been I've been absolutely robbed. We 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 totally should have got that there. Wait, did, hang on a minute. I've got I had a feeling I may have had iron on me the entire time there, but the village came in handy. Get out the bed. I need that as well. The village came in handy because we managed to kill him and we managed to get the flint and steel. If you're wondering why I've actually done that, oh, I'll tell you what. That actually gives us a really convenient way to get over to the uh, the the villager place. But the reason why I've done that is because if we go through the nether portal real quick like this. Bing bong. Uh, is there anything I need that I'm leaving behind here? Like this. I'll leave the iron behind. Uh, you know what? I don't actually need any of this. I don't need that either. I'll take the wood, sure. All right, let's go on through. I'm going to leave the gold up top. I don't really need that. All right, we go through. All we need to do in here... Oh, I thought... I genuinely thought my game had crashed then. Okay. <gasps> no, wait. There it is. There's the achievement. Is it a balloon? We've complete. Oh, shit. Thank God I didn't leave that in the chest. I almost did. You know what? You're annoying. Oh, wait. Did it? All right. Oh. oh, I thought I fell off a big drop then. Uh, okay. So we've come through here. I've got the, 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 the screenshots coordinate of that. We can now, with the cookies, run back over there. Get the parrots to be our friends. Um, I don't know if that's how you breed the parrots. Might have to do some testing with that. I could be completely wrong. But... Uh, I think all things lead in the right direction. Okay. Parrot, 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 parrot. Yes, parrot. Hello. Polly, what a cracker? What? So... I think it turns out that you are supposed to feed them seeds. And that's what you use to breed them instead of seeds. Because the cookie exploded it. Of which now gives me the problem of I don't know if there's a second parrot in this area for me to be able to breed with the one we found earlier. Oh, I've done goofed. Where's the parrot gone though? I think this was where it was. Oh no. Oh this has gone, this went from so good to so wrong so quick. Let, let me just hope that it was like over here where the parrot was. How did I manage that? 
Wait, I thought you were supposed to feed them cookies for goodness sake. How did I, how did I actually manage that? I am an idiot. Right, right, right. Okay, so I found, <laughs> let's not feed it a cookie. I'm going to go to Google and see what you need to get bread. No, 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 no. I, I read that you can use any type of seed. So I had this coke. Oh, is this a bean? Oh, it's a bean. <gasps> but I put my cookies in that slot there in the in the just ability just to, to, to hold them. And when I right clicked it. For... <sighs> this episode was going so well. And then it's gone so wrong so fast. I, I don't know what to do. I, I don't know what to do. I'm just going to have to scour this area in the hopes that there's another parrot. Two parrots. Parrots. <laughs> parrot eyes. Just chilling that I can breed. Because there's no way we've come this far to be this disappointed. Surely not. There's got to be more. I can't believe it was the perfect amount as well. And I've just blown them up with, with cookies. Do you know what? You need to piss off. Have I at least eaten one? I, th I think I've eaten one. If I've not, I'm going to... Wait, let's, let's check. Oh, parrot ship. Let me check, let me check, let me check, let me check. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where's my... Where's my... Is it in husbandry? 17. Go down. 18. I never need you again. Go away. Please, can I find some more parrots on this aisle? Please, 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 please. Man, this is not looking good. I can't hear any squawking whatsoever. As, as if there was actually the perfect amount. As if there was two parrots for me to be able to breed. And I've freaking blown them both up. I'm an idiot. I'm an actual idiot. I'm an idiot sandwich, man. Oh, my lord. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go over to that boat real quick, loot that boat, just in case there's anything of value in there, and then come back into here, and hopefully it, like, refreshes the mobs and the entities on the land. I don't know if that's even a thing, but it's what I'm going to do uh, in the off chance that I can get more pirates to spawn, because otherwise, we're screwed. Okay, here's to hoping there's some good looting on board. Uh, is, is it in here? Wait, where am I going? Oh, wait, I think I am... I think I'm underneath the ship, not in the captain's quarters. Get me up here, then swim me into here. Well, there we go. All right, where is the loot? Don't tell me that. Oh, there you go. What is this? Okay, that is the most shambles amount of loot uh, I could ever find. Uh, I actually don't need any of that, but I don't think I've bred pigs. So you know what? I'm going to take that with me because I passed pigs on the way, and I may be able to tick pigs as a breeding thing off my list. Could be, uh, I might be wrong, but I don't think I've done that yet. So, yeah, this could be a win. Here, piggy, 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 piggy. Wait, could I have used golden carrots on the pigs? Am I about to find out I'm an actual idiot and I could have done this way sooner? One sec, let me check. No, I can't. Thank gosh. Right, sweet. Man, we got lucky that we could use it on the goats, though. That was great. Or the, cat, or the, or the, the rabbits. I met the rabbits. There we go. Oh, I didn't check where I was up to on the breeding thing. Oh, uh, uh, where's, where's the, where's the, where's the breed... All animals. Eight out of twenty-one. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna class that as the, uh, that that worked. Oh yeah, okay, you can have one. <laughs> I'm gonna class that as that did actually work. Probably didn't, but yeah. Pigs, pigs are now done. Just time for parrots. Guess the only hope is to just keep running back and forth, back and forth, back and forth between these two small biome areas, and yeah, just hope that a parrot appears because. Um, I don't think just standing in the same place is going to get them to appear. So, uh, oh, damn it, we're back at the the, the, the pawn of pandas. Oh, great, just exactly where I want to be. And look what I have found whilst I'm here. That is an azalea tree. So I think I can show the myth that I was talking about before. Whereas if you dig straight down, like straight down. Okay, this is probably going to end up in my death. But if you dig straight down when you see like one of them colored leaf trees... It should pop you out in... A, oh, okay, maybe this is it just yet, but maybe keep keep going. Oh, yeah, it does. It brings you out in a lush cave area. Yes, I was right. However, uh, it's an underground part of the lush cave area. But if you see one of those colored trees, it does indeed bring you out in a lush cave. Look at that. Ah, oh, a little bit of myth busting for your faces there. Um, now I need to go back to the surface and <laughs> find the parrots. Oh, I'm being 200 IQ in my time whilst I'm waiting here. And I've managed to get a new... You're joking me. That did, The disc I've just picked up is called Chirp. <laughs> that, is, that is just not fair. I'm trying to get parrots. And in the meantime, I'm farming CDs. CDs nuts. 
from uh, from skeletons and creepers, and uh, I managed to get the the CD called Chirp. Yeah, that is just a kick in the absolute teeth. That, but uh, I do believe it's one we've not had before. So, uh, yay! I have to bring this to your attention. Okay, I've I've actually just googled um like the the ratios of 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 parrots spawning in jungles, and it says the spawning of parrots in Minecraft is they have a zero. <laughs> 0.2% chance to spawn in jungle biomes. A 0.2% chance. And we managed to find two of them and I killed both of them. This is this is absolute torture right now. So I think I am gonna have to admit defeat. This is not an achievement that we can actually tick off our list right now. It's just one that like works towards actually. You know, uh, doing the whole breeding every animal, just the two by two. I, 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 I would love to have a parrot pet and tame it and take it home with us. I think that would be great. I think you can get them to like dance near jukeboxes and stuff like that. But um, I am getting severely low on food, and I think I have just absolutely killed the percentage chance of us being able to actually get <laughs> get another parrot. Like, if the percent chance is zero point two percent chance, we managed to get two of them. And I killed both of them. Uh, I don't think we stand a chance in a good long time of them spawning back. I've been running all the way around uh, this aisle to where I've been up to the village. I've run around all that aisle. And then all the way across there, just running in circles. And I've had no luck whatsoever. I am kind of happy that it's not, a, you know, like a full achievement. Like we can tick off like here. It's not like, you know, uh, breed two parrots together and just have it to take back with us. Like it's not one of those ones that I can like tick off and be done with. But uh, wait, what is that? Team up with an oxalot and win a fight. Eh? Oh, I think I know what that is, actually. I think that's if I put an oxalot in the water and then hit a drowned guy, it should start attacking him or something like that. But uh, yeah, I think I'm going to have to admit defeat here. I know where to get back to this jungle. So if we ever need to return to here, I will just simply come back and we'll just have to do it like that. So yeah, I'm, 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 I am admitting defeat. I'm going to leave the seeds here for when we return to breed the parrots with um, in the hopes that they are here. I think the only thing we could potentially do is come back, just level out this area um, and place, I think it's like the jungle logs because that's what the parrots actually spawn on and just create, uh, try and create some sort of a parrot farm. I don't know if that's possible, but uh, yeah, this is just not looking promising at all. So I think it's time we head back to our doggy. We get in our boat and we head on home. I'm just going to do one quick uh, wide rotation out just in case we can find one and uh, fingers crossed it is possible, but I think alas, it's home time. This homie down here has been like, where the hell have you bloody been? I'm just like, listen, dog. All right, everything was going swell until I learned the life lesson of do not feed pigeons or birds with wings. All right, <laughs> seeds. I learned a very valuable lesson today. Oh, home sweet home, baby. We made it. From 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 shooting the blocks up at the, uh, at the top there to the redstone, to the shenanigans, to everything. That has unfolded on this journey. Oh, I completely just conf forgot to bring in home Bruno, a new friend. Let's introduce them. I, ho I hope they get along well. Oh my gosh. Get on in here. Get on in here. Where are you? Where are you? Oh, Bruno, say hello um, to whoever the heck this is going to be. I have, I have no idea what name. Wait, can I use just to, just to differentiate the two? Do I have to use this to make blue dye? Do I mean a oh, blue dye? Can I put the blue dye? on you to work out the difference. I can! So we've now got Bruno and whatever you guys decide upon name. I'm going to be able to sleep in my own bed. Oh, the comfort levels are over 9,000. We can comfortably sit back, pull up the to-do list of what we were supposed to achieve today and say, we managed to do the bullseye achievement. We managed to get the hired help achievement, which was obviously shoot the bullseye, build the golem. We managed to do the light as a rabbit, which was walking on the snow. We managed to do the whatever floats your goat with a goat in the boat. We managed to get the, is it a bird looking through a parrot with a spyglass? Is it a balloon looking at a ghast? The only one we haven't done is the caves and cliffs. Now, I was going to do this here, but I do indeed need to wrap up this episode because we are getting to a point where we are like overly, overly filmed with what we've been up to. And I think we should say that potentially for the start of the next episode of which you guys know that when I jump and land, if I die, you guys are going to get paid the cash money. I can't even believe I've got to give away as many Razor headsets as I have. That is just ridiculous. And I kind of need to just decompress from this journey that we've been on because this has been 
just stupidity on a whole nother level. Like, we have... We've come back with diamonds. We've come back with, like, how, like, the amount of saddles. Like, don't forget, we've got all the loot that we managed to bring back that was in our ender chest. But because I've got no more nether... Uh, what was it? Got? I've, got, I've got no more obsidian. I'm going to have to go and farm some. Uh, I can't even make one to actually get back in it. We've managed to bring back CDs, which we do it... Oh, unfortunate. We did indeed have three of the same CD now. But we managed to get some music discs, which... This is the chirp playlist, ladies and gentlemen, which we're going to turn off straight away because it's making it to be depressed that we didn't manage to get the, the parrot's bread. We got all the amethyst shards that we managed to find along the way, which is absolute stonks. I didn't realize I actually had so much already. Oh, and how did I even forget? We've got the trident in the next episode that we can work on maxing out, getting mending on and fully improve our get up because... We're going to be able to start traveling over water distances super, super fast. And when it's stormy, fly through the rain to just explore even more. But we have done so much this episode. It has been amazing. I just want to say, if you guys have enjoyed this, I love making these episodes. And it's been so nice to have like a purpose to work towards. Because if this was just a normal Let's Play, I would very much get burnt out in scenarios where it's like, oh, what do I build today? What do I do today? But having the achievements to work towards and complete is the whole reason why I wanted to make this series. But um we've got a lot still to complete we do realistically need to get killing the ender dragon and for the amount of time it takes to get around i'm really thinking i want to go and get the elytra so you never know in the next episode we may do two birds one stone kill the ender dragon look at the ender dragon through the spyglass because that is actually a, uh, the achievement that we need to get so might as well try and get that done obviously we've got the uh, the trident that we can get uh get get absolutely swagged out um, and then we could potentially get an elytra through it as well. So that could be sick of chips. But it is that point in the video where I need to quickly grab a sign. So I will be taking one of you. And I will be running across to here and taking, I believe, a glow ink sack. Thank you very much. And we will be putting a new member on the Wall of Legends. Now, you guys know how this works. If you want to get your name on the Wall of Legends, like these people over here, then all you got to do is leave a comment. It could be anything. It could be uh, uh, something funny, something uh, hilariously insulting me for killing parrots. It could be whatever. But if you guys leave a comment like this person now, who was indeed from Frill, actually got me giggling and laughing out loud because in the last video, when I placed all the tropical fish in the water, they all just went and just disappeared into the mountainside. It was hilarious. But Frill Real comment and say the tropical fish had an Augustus glute moment. And if you don't get that reference, it is a Charlie of the Chocolate Factory reference and it had me dying. So, Frill, thanks for leaving your comment. I really appreciate your support on the videos and for watching them. Uh, yeah, leave a comment and you never know, you might end up in the Wall of Legends. And I, I legitimately just am in awe of how much we've achieved. Like, even on that list of things that we, like, meant to have, have, have completed, we have done so much more. Like, again, on screen the list, we have done so much more that we didn't aim to actually achieve, but we ended up doing. So it's just been absolutely incredible. This has been one of our, our most progressive videos in the series so far, and we have just got wonders done. And we still haven't even got a good bedroom to sleep in, so that is just an absolute win in my eyes. But guys, I'm going to thank you for watching. I do indeed need to wrap up this video. I hope you have enjoyed it. Leave a like, right, and click the subscribe button, and I will see you guys in the next episode of Micro Project, probably next week. So until then, much love. Prepare for us to fight the Ender Dragon, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks.